Another day, another major American company is whitewashing Ukrainian Nazis. First Disney, now Netflix, which is carrying a film about the 3rd Separate Assault Brigade, an offshoot of the Azov Battalion. The 3rd Separate Assault Brigade has since its inception maintained a green light to receive weapons from NATO countries and was trained by the French military. One Ukrainian fighter even had an SS tattooed on his face, according to a French investigative outlet. One member, quote, gave Hitler salutes and takes a selfie with a neck warmer decorated with a Celtic cross. A second poses with the emblems of the SS divisions Totenkampf and Galicia. Two others are also fond of Totenkampf, which they wear on a patch or a t-shirt. On April 20, Adolf Hitler's birthday, another soldier in the group is shown posing in front of a mural in his honor. The commander of the 3rd Assault Brigade is none other than Andrei Beletsky, the former founder of the Azov Battalion, who famously vowed to lead the white races of the world in the final crusade against the Semite-led Untermenschen. If you haven't watched our deep dive on the Azov Battalion, I highly recommend you check it out after this video. While the film was made to look like a documentary, it's not. It's got paid actors, a script, and it's listed as a mockumentary by Netflix. It was just released on July 3rd, and only the next day, it's already ranking third in the country behind Beverly Hills Cop and a rom-com about Zac Efron banging Nicole Kidman. The film is directed by a man named Lubomir Levitsky, who studied at the Aspen Institute think tank in Kiev. This think tank, which received significant funding from the United States government, was actually responsible for preparing social media and traditional media companies ahead of the Hunter Biden laptop story to help them frame it as Russian disinformation. Meanwhile, the film was financed by a company called Favbet, a Ukrainian online gambling company which was granted exemption from Ukraine's draconian conscription laws. According to the director Levitsky, special screenings were organized for the Pentagon, the United States Senate, and foreign diplomats. Quote, I want them and the American taxpayers to see where their money is going and in whose hands those weapons are in. And according to Levitsky, some of the funds for this project will go directly to the 3rd Assault Brigade. So if you're watching Netflix, you could be funding neo-Nazism. Hey everyone, um, if you enjoyed this video or, or any of our other content, uh, please give us a follow on Twitter or subscribe to us on YouTube. It will help us beat the algorithm oligarchs. Thank you.